I've always known I was a writer. Even as a small child, I remember standing in a crib, so I had to be maybe two years old or less, um, leaning over the side of the crib to talk to my sister, who was two years older, and telling stories to her. And I always tell her it's her fault that I'm a writer because she actually stopped to listen to these two-year-old stories. And I thought I was really doing something because I had made a four-year-old stop and listen to something that I had to say. I think the reason why I was drawn to playwriting is that my father, uh, was a minister, and I always admired his ability to take very complicated ideas and translate them into language that regular hardworking people could understand. I think the moment when I realized I really was going to commit to do it was when I saw um, Raisin in the Sun when I was about 11 years old. We all crowded in to see it, and it was an all-black audience, and we looked at this play and we saw ourselves on that stage. My neighbors saw themselves on that stage. And at the end of the play, we all stood up and clapped for easily 15 or 20 minutes. I mean, nonstop. And all of us were hoping that they would come back and do the play again, which of course no cast is ever gonna do that. But if they had, we would have all taken our seats and stayed to see it again. And I remember walking out into the snow with my mother and saying, that's what I want to do. I want to write plays like that. And my mother, being the great mother that she was, said, well, then that's what you should do. And I did.